I don't think so, Jake. I think we'll, uh, I mean, I, I think we'll manage. Uh, I'm just gonna update the filter here to better. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, Jake. Don't, don't, uh, don't feel the need to watch. You could, you could stream. I don't, uh, I would not take it, uh, take it amiss. Um, uh, things I think are going reasonably well. I think while I wait for this timer to go down, we'll just go over uh, over things. <laughs> well, then, uh, glad to be of entertainment. Um, so yeah, I guess we'll do a rundown while we wait for the timer to to go on. Uh, we've got the three bases. We have uh, Bainecock, the Barony, and Bill Cast Tree. Um, Tech-wise, we're progressing fairly well. Um, we've unlocked Plasma Tech, although I have very few Plasma weapons at the moment. Yeah, I, um, I have good coverage of all the continents. Uh, so I don't think, unless I fail a terror mission, I don't think I'll be losing any continents. Uh, although Soviet Union is uh, Soviet Union and Europe are poor, which is uh, not great. South Africa is bad. Average in Australasia, average in South America, good here and bad in North America. Um, but these two bases are the newer ones, so hopefully I'll be able to recover the relations. Did I sweep USSR for a base last time? I did not. I should probably sweep the northern section of the USSR. Um, well, actually, that's a good question. What actually happened on the last mission? Let's go take a look. Oh, right. Yeah. At the end of the last mission, I, um, I defended a base assault uh, successfully. We only lost two guys. Uh, that was despite having a big mob of, uh, of unarmored uh, dudes. Um, we captured a base near Mexico City. We lost Conway, uh, and we lost uh, Pizza Two near Barcelona. Uh, we did have one very bad mission in this campaign, uh, where we had a full squad wipe, but um, losses have been otherwise minimal, comparatively. Oh, actually, I have to rename my tank here. Uh, uh, in honor of the uh, weekly one shot, we'll name this the Cortez. Um, and, okay. Uh, I have, I believe I have, did I hire some people? Yeah, I hired uh, I hired a handful of people. We got Chasro 2, Cooled Debrouillage, Elvon Door Open, It's a Shield, and SS2 coming in. Uh, yeah, an actual tank, proper gear. Um, this, <laughs> yes, yeah. Uh, I think I even have armor for a significant portion of the of the team. Um, yeah, I'm a bit tight on alloys. No, Earth Two is going uh, well. I've learned my lessons. Oh, well, at least I've learned, I've learned some lessons. Um, got three spare sets of armor. Uh, we should probably level up Blubber Abyss. Uh, let's give Captain Howe a break. Uh, and give Sergeant Dark Young two a break. Sergeant Dark Young two has been uh, putting in some work. He successfully captured a base, and then he def successfully defended the base. So he, he's uh, he's been doing good good stuff. Okay, and let's bring in Private Blubber Abyss. Get him, uh, get him a little, toughen him up. We'll bring in uh, Cortez the tank. No, I have a tank. It's the Cortez. Uh, just recently rebuilt. Um, we we lost the Scimitar tank in a. Uh, 
in the uh, base assault, unfortunately. Uh, possibly. <laughs> That's happened a few times, yeah, Bane. Um, the, um, the planes on the higher levels are pretty tough. I don't think I've lost an entire squadron just yet. Um, I think I do want to build another plane here. So I could build another Foxtrot. No, it's not. I decided to name it after uh, after your recently your just completed uh, one shot. Figured uh, why not name it the Cortez. Um, so I'm not 100% sure on what I should build here, but I think we'll go with another another Foxtrot. Although cash is it's very tight. How close are we to the end of the month? Not close at all. Plasma Carbine. Do Precision Plasma Rifle. Take up all my alien alloys. You know what? I think I uh, I want more planes, so we're gonna build another plane. Yeah, it'll co cost us a bunch of money, but I think as I shoot down aircraft, uh, we'll we'll be doing okay. Uh, we've got some progress on alien interrogation, so that's good. And yeah, science is progressing. I'm going to keep all 20 on the Heavy Plasma, because I think it'll give us um, free upgrades on our aircraft, which is always a good thing. Yeah, we last last mission we lost the big uh, big Minette base upgrade. <laughs> Look at the scientist. Uh, having covered our scientific exploits and unlocking the secrets of alien bat base, uh, improvements to our own facilities. Seen in our libraries and laboratories and workshops, both structures now allow scientists to work almost 50% more efficiently than before. Hmm. But uh, there have also been a number of less obvious improvements to our base, for example, uh, with laser-based ovens. <laughs> uh, finally, we have developed an internal network that links all our systems. Uh, this more uh, mildly amusing image of a cat halfway across the world, suggesting it will be an excellent tool for sharing classified information within our organization. <laughs> I named this impressive creation the Internet Work, and would be very surprised if it did not catch on. Excellent. Uh, so we've got five dudes to reassign. Um, thinking we put them on alien plasma cannon. So do our, do our bases look a little different? Quantum Laboratory. Yeah, okay, cool. Nanotech Workshop. So yeah, I did upgrade our... Uh, it was a kind of a free upgrade, you could say. Okay, so let's intercept that guy. Pretty sure we're going to have to send the whole crew to get it. Okay, intercept that guy. Send two fox shots and a condor. Uh, could send a fox shot from Bellcat's tree. Yeah, let's send a, a single fox shot from Bellcat's tree. Oh boy, these big guys are uh, are fast. <laughs> Just leaving my. Uh, my interceptor is in the dust. Uh oh. Uh, okay. Now uh, we're out of fuel. Okay, get out of here. Ooh, 61% victory. Well, let's give it a go. Excellent. Um, all right. So we'll return to the base. Uh, we're just going to intercept that because it's a bit far from my uh, from my squad. And I need cash more than anything else. Uh, so we're going to wait for our aircraft to refuel a bit. Okay, great. We finished that. Wow, we finished that Foxtrot interceptor really quickly. 
Let me intercept that. Let's try. Oh, it's coming. It's the North American aircraft. Just way too slow. Uh, okay, let's we'll send a fox shot after that guy. Let's see strike it. I am going to have to send out, uh... I think these guys are going to get wrecked if I try to send them after the uh, three interceptors like that. Okay, let's try sending two fox shots and a condor. Maybe they'll catch it. Rapid fire plasma. Uh, we fight against the extraterrestrials. Uh, okay. Uh, plasma bolt. Uh, da -da -da -da. I guess we'll, we can just spread our scientists out among these uh, remaining research areas. Okay. Mm. Yeah, the thing is, I can't, I could build a Corsair Interceptor. I don't have the next level of tech yet. I think I'll unlock it with one of these. Okay, we got our soldiers. Thinking I will... Give uh, one of our lieutenants a break. We'll bring on bring on the voyage too. Alright. So I've been Ah, uh, okay. Corsairs are the best fighters. See, I thought the um, I thought there was another level of plane after the Corsairs, and that one is like just all around superior to all the others. Some of the stuff I was reading online said um, it's just not worth it to. Uh... There are two. Ah. Okay. Hey, Merrick, how you doing? I guess we can start research on this uh, quantum cryptology center. I do have a bunch of lazy en engineers, uh, but I need more uh, alienium before I can uh, do that. So I'm going to have to uh, actually do an assault. Okay, well, that's very useful. I'll use them. I just wish you could get some money back for selling your uh, your condors. Okay, well, let's uh, intercept these guys. Uh, no, you can only capture them from um, by shooting down uh, alien uh, aircraft and then and then going out and doing a um, a mission to take them out. Okay. Successful interception there. So we're going to go and uh, take that one out. Can two condors take that out? Probably not. Oh, but I could send two condors and a foxtrot. No, that doesn't work. Okay. Uh, let's send 
our Foxtrot after that guy. Nuke him. And we're just going to airstrike that. Have we rearmed? No. Not yet. Ooh. These guys are pretty, uh, pretty hardy. Because we're out of fuel, this heavy fighter is going to wreck everyone. Uh, it's a zero percent chance. We interceptor has a little fuel. It will not be able to return to base. So can you return to the base now? No. If it's dead anyway. We can we can save the uh, fox shot. And, and we'll send the condors after it. Oh wow, he just annihilated my condors. Great. But I think we saved the fox shot. We did. Those guys just are. This is bad. Yeah. <laughs> nope, you gotta build your own. Okay. Well, let's make sure we, we kit everybody out because I put some uh, new privates in here. So. Lottery Abyss, what did you want? Uh, where are you, Blubber Abyss? Blubber Abyss 2. Ah, uh, he just wanted to be a rifleman. Okay. Well, I think I've got a nice laser rifle for you. Give you some, uh, some things. We'll give you a wolf armor. I think instead of a flashbang, we'll give you a gas grenade. 61 TU is still pretty decent. Yeah, you're a sergeant. We've had uh, much better survival rates uh, this time around. Uh, Private Cool Debrouillage, what did you want to be? A rocket launcher? Uh, I don't know about giving you rockets. Let's see, it's got lots of time units, lots of health, good strength, decent accuracy, crappy resources, re reflexes, crappy, uh, uh, crappy bravery. I think we're gonna give you a scatter laser. It's still a heavy weapon. That's uh, close enough in spirit. Um, yeah, okay. So I've got two heavy weapons. I've got a single shield, two assault guys. I have a rifleman. Uh, how's your accuracy? 51. Got lots of time units. Uh, hold in. Taciturn. Oh, right. Thank you. Thank you for the reminder. I do have plasma pistols. Let's give them those plasma pistols. Increases killing power. Um, I would like to have a sniper. And I actually think uh, we might make Heldin a sniper. 
or oh, maybe a taciturn. Yeah, the shields aren't uh, aren't great at the moment. I don't think there are better shields. No, the shields are still uh, still pretty crummy. Um, we're gonna make taciturn a sniper. Uh, it's, it's it's nice to have a sniper. We'll leave him on the heavy weapons roll just so we uh, I don't forget. Okay. But eventually there are better shields. Um, we don't have access to them yet. Uh, hmm. Well, we had better med kits. I guess not. There must be some other tech that unlocks better med kits. I don't like having a single med kit. Uh, surely you say assault, but you're equipped as a shield guy. Do I want two shields? Switch you to shield. Yeah, why don't we why don't we go with two shields? Good bit plasma pistol. Now we're gonna have to. Oh boy, you're gonna have to get a lot more swivels, shouldn't we? Weapons. Can we sneak a med kit onto you? Yeah. Is that that's a scatter laser? It's actually. That. Lasers. There we go. Grenades, give you a smoke grenade and a gas grenade, I guess. Ah, uh, really? Okay. So I have to actually capture a lizard. <laughs> um, I actually haven't had very many uh, missions where I fight the lizards. Uh, yeah, right, I decided to leave you on the heavy weapons. Um, that give you a sniper rifle because I wanted a sniper. And okay, that's probably okay. And let's go ahead and say intercept with the Red Baron 2. Planes in North America have been uh, annihilated. And okay, yeah, so I need. A lot of uh, a lot of goods here in order to get better aircraft. What kind of plane is it? Yeah. Okay. Let's uh. Oh boy. Oh, right, okay. I had the wrong base selected. Okay, so I have to go back to the main base. Because uh, I have more stuff there. Oh, crumbs. I forgot to uh, reorganize my guys. Uh, not great. over here. We'll move Cortez up. Hmm. Oh, we found an alien. Where is it? Aha! Here's our chance to capture a civilian. Um, 
but not the <laughs> he he's not going to be captured uh okay but good to know we are fighting civilians on this map so don't bother with uh gas attacks and we need to be very careful about uh, reapers oh what the hell was that something i didn't realize they they came in mixed crews like that uh did the voyage can you kill this thing is this actually blocked i don't want the tank to get hurt there we go now it's not showing uh Great shooting, Debriage. Uh, lover. Can you hit this thing? Get two shots at 30%. Missed. Missed. Yeah, but he still had a... Um, he had decent chances, but... Uh, did not hit. Uh, taciturn. Got a 74% chance at 33. Okay. Uh, nope. Okay. That's your best shot. Done. Nice. Okay. Why don't you move up? Uh, Heldin, move on up with him. Hmm, I really don't like this position we're in here. There is no. I haven't found any really good cover. I'm afraid we're gonna start eating, uh, eating a lot of shots coming at us. Um, tight. Why don't you move up here? Oh, we found another one. Of effective range. We have a uh, not good shots at either. Turn. Fifty-four percent chance. Oh, we winged him. How about you, hybrid? You have a chance. Very low chance. What about tank? Is there any chance you're going to hit this thing? 25%. It's going to take all your TU, basically. I okay, just as soon take a chance with Degoyage to take this thing out. It's pretty low odds, though. Got him. All right. Uh, okay. Let's get you to move up there. Tight, move up here. We're, we're just going to commit to a direction. We'll head up this way. Uh, actually, Shinley, why don't you just keep an eye on this direction? Uh, Cortez. Can you 
you come over this way, we'll have you keep an eye on the front. Okay. Uh, we'll then move up this way a little bit. Tag one, you can move up here. Ah, we found the map, edge of the map, okay. So maybe we can move up over this way. Towards them. Faster and run over here. This come up this way. Some cover. Tank, I guess we'll move you up here. Oh. Okay, well, at least they're kind enough to move into the open where we can uh, annihilate them. Yeah, you can get to uh, 49% shots. Then you hit there. Don't want to take him out with cool de Riage. I don't want to risk uh, this guy reaction firing on, on my guy, so we'll take him out with the uh, scatter laser. I kind of wanted to try out the plasma pistol there, but uh, it was wiser to be a bit safe. Well, no hint of, uh, no hint of Reapers yet. Oh, but you might move up a little bit. Last turn, and move around that side of the cover. Okay. spot for you. Cortez. Yeah, yeah, those uh, flying dudes, they just kind of go splat when you kill them. It's fairly satisfying. Okay. There. Elden. Run up here. Yeah, I don't know how you would capture one of those alive. I think you, I think they maybe sometimes land. So you'd have to wait until they, uh, basically wait until they land and then and then capture them that way. Anything inside here? No. Okay, shouldn't like it over here. Blubber, can you get in to this courtyard? You can. Great. Elden. Yeah, let's run over here. And Cortez, what are we gonna do with you? Oh, there's the uh, there's the dropship.
Do I take a shot at the door? I think we'll leave it closed for now. And we'll uh, we'll bring the squad into position. Hey, Hoovy, good to good to see you. Oh yeah, if uh, if you're feeling like it, you could uh, submit a trooper, and odds are I will send it to die. But it will be a almost certainly a glorious death. Certainly would not. Um, I would certainly not throw its life away um, with a poorly thought out reach action. Let's uh, just take a quick peek inside here. Okay. <laughs> sure, I would never. Yeah, exactly. I would never do such a thing. Um, yeah. Oh yeah, get on over here. Elden, get it. No, get in here. So I wonder if we've killed all the wandering troops. It's always hard to know. It didn't seem like we uh, we encountered all that many of them. So there could very well be more of them out here. Oh no! Ugh. Damn it, hybrid. Uh, task turn. We can get good shots on the doors. Good. Uh, I think, yeah, we'll send... We'll do voyage over here. We can uh, crouch behind this rock. We'll send uh, Blubber Abyss this way too. Then we'll have our shields and shotgunner over this way. I don't know if the tank can reaction fire, but I'll save his. Um, is to use just in case. I don't actually have a clear shot there, so why don't we move you over here? I do you have a clear shot? Cannot reaction fire. Okay. In that case, let's just uh, open the door. Let's just open the door. There we go. Can you care, kill this poor fool? Oh, we suppressed him. Can you kill this poor fool? Do you get a... Do you get a clear line of sight in here? Sort of. Okay. Shield smooth up a little bit. Sight in here. I don't trust it. So we're going to have these guys crouch here. Where are my riflemen? Decent view. Okay, tank, why don't you get right up in their business? Okay. Okay. Everyone in here seems to be dead. Good. guys up. Good. 
Okay. Do I blast a hole through this door? It's probably safer than uh, sending my guys to do like an actual breach. Although you could hit this stuff, and this is all. Um, it's a lot of valuable aluminium. Let's actually move the tank directly into the ship. You volunteer to ding dong? <laughs> Um, yeah, I've had a few... Oh, um... Oh, so, like, they, they don't even survive the crash landing? I don't think I've had one of those. I have killed every single alien before, but, uh... Not the, um... All the aliens died on, uh, on landing. Hybrid, since you volunteered. Oh. Okay, so this area is safe. Uh, left or right? Oh. As Jake likes to say, never do anything right, so let's go up the left side. I don't think any uh, any ETs are coming this way, and we'll have Cortez watch the uh, the other teleporter. Okay. Then why don't you come over here? We'll read this. You can come over here. Here. All right. Okay. No aliens popping through. All right, hit tight. Take the teleporter. Okay, nothing but a dead civilian in here. Perfect kind of civilian. <laughs> Every hit tight is the shield of Terra. Oh, interesting. We get to see a little bit of the other room. It's nice. And Alden, get in here as well. Gonna move you again just in case you're able to get a snapshot. Blubber. Cool debris. Then taciturn. Uh, our number one ding donger, the voyage. Okay, nothing here. Should we go take a peek? Or nothing? Elden.
Maybe there's a guy hiding in here. Oh, hi, Bridge. You stay there. I think this thing is explosive. I really don't want to find out uh, the hard way, but... Uh... So he's out here hiding here, or he's in this room? Okay. Well, let's find out if he's hiding in this corner. Oh, there he is. Right, I wanted to... I wanted to capture this guy alive. So let's try gassing him. Does it take you to throw a grenade 44 to you? Throw a grenade. Thirty-nine. Be able to do it. Okay. Well, his air should be mostly gas by now. So let's see if we. Oh God. <coughs> Oh, there's another one. Uh, stay tight. Why? Abyss, why? <laughs> oh, bro. Take shots at this guy, or do I just run? We do have a plasma pistol. Is it gonna kill it? Probably not. Yeah, take the shot. All right, let's take the shot. So we can do two shots with twenty-six. Oh, why don't we do it? Damn it, Shinley. Can you run? You get in slightly better cover. Alright, well... Gosh. <laughs> yeah, I think Shinley might die. Shinley. Uh, wonderful. Cool de Bruyage is bleeding. Cool de Bruyage is broken and fleeing. Great, so I have a number of guys who are completely unarmed. Man, okay. I think it's 
we're gonna have to arm ourselves with alien arm ourselves with alien weaponry. Hybrid. Pick up his gun. Do you have a med kit at least? You do. Okay. So you can patch yourself up on your next turn. Tank's just hanging out at the first floor, wondering what's going on. Alright. Voyage. Patch yourself up. not injured. Do you have any grenades? You have a smoke grenade, which is useless against civilians. Uh, let's drop that elenium grenade on the ground. That too. Okay. Come over here. Reach down. Those grenades, I guess. Is that another grenade you could pick up? Yeah, okay. Oh, did that guy just get knocked out? Can you hit him? Yeah, but we'll stun the heck out of her, guys. Mm. It's on the first floor, but it can't really... it can't come upstairs. Low chances to hit with the uh... try taking him out with an alien grenade. Let's give that a go. Percent, I think you'd be able to move out of the way. Okay, get out of the way. Yeah, we'll still suppress them. Oh well. Okay. Let's do that again. We'll open up the door. Oh, you're out of ammo. Great. Do you have laser ammo? You do. Uh, drop those on the ground. Oh, he does have a magazine. Great. I just dropped some rounds in the corner for this guy, though. Okay. 
You know what? Why don't I run Debriage over here? Where is he gonna be able to throw a grenade? Grenade. I still see just the one, but I know there's a second one because uh, there were two of them. And if one was gonna get knocked out by my gas grenades, he would have been like right here. Way. And do your best. Okay. Pretty pretty useless with these alien guns. Okay. Uh... Might be worth it to try to run in here. Just like zero cover here. Yeah, the thing is, I think there's another one hiding right here. Okay. Still gonna be able to get his shot. At least suppress. on the ground there. That's our sniper rifle. <laughs> Just refuses to die. <laughs> Please hit him. Useful grenades left? No. <laughs> Shush, Jake. Uh, okay. All right. Uh... That used up all the to you. Okay. Grab the sniper rifle. Run into this room. Okay. Uh, can we do something similar?
Hey, Belcat. How you doing? Things were going well with this mission. Uh, right up until this last section. Well, if with any luck, you'll get back up. But um, that has not been the theme here. Many have survived more than one mission. Um, we've just had a spell of bad luck. Well, believe it or not, I made it into the section with an entire team, and then uh, one grenade almost wiped the entire team out. Okay. I decided I wanted to try to capture one of these guys alive, which was uh, foolish. I should have just killed him. Oh my gosh. Wonderful. Oh, he shot me around a corner? I don't know. I guess, yeah, I guess he saw him there. Nope, we're out of grenades. This guy can't have that much health left, can he? Freaking dead riage. Come on, dead. Just just kill the bastard. health there. Come on, Deb, kill him. <laughs> yep, probably. Uh... Where did we drop the machine gun? Right over here. Let's, let's go the safe way around. I mean, they still have the tank. If Deb dies, then we will we'll have to flee with the tank. Keep the pistol in case. Okay. 
Exactly, Jake. In case we need to uh, off ourselves. Just kill the freaking bastard. Christ. Uh, maybe they'll be nice enough to come down here. Can the tank go upstairs? Let's get out of here. Well, that was brutal. I really wish I had just, um, I had just killed the, the guy when I saw him. I had my whole team there. Uh. Oh, that was horrible. Well, normally the, uh, well, usually I find the tank is a good decision, but yeah, maybe I should not bring them in the future. Uh, Yeah, I probably would have been um, would have been wrecked if I uh, tried to use sticks though, since there was that second guy uh, hiding around the corner. One gas is enough. Yeah, you guys are all dead. Man, that was that was a ton of gear I just lost to. Uh, the lost equipment is the uh, is the most punishing then thing there. I don't know if I can I'll be able to recover from that. See if two fox shots can take it out. Send a single fox shot for that one. Some condors after it. Oh, but that's three of them. There's no way we're taking that out. Return to base. Return to base. 
let's tail that till it's over land. The condos are still shredded. Um, it's in, like, southern-ish America, and Bellcat is often in chat, so I just named it, named the base Bellcat's tree. Nothing, uh, nothing too much to it. Let's take it out, turn to the base. Let's get some cash. Take it out, return to base, and I'm gonna try to distract them with the condors. Select a new target over here. Uh, they're all beaten up. Strike that. Are you guys gonna be able to make it back to base? Nice. Okay. Okay, so two condors can take out uh, a triple fighter squad. I thought I was gonna lose the condors there. Um, but turns out two of them are, is enough. Uh, no, an air team. Hmm. <laughs> That's funny, it's just a number. Yeah, we, uh, we may lose uh, council funding here. I feel like they're probably building another base. Uh... I need more wool farmer. Got enough resources to build three more sets. So we'll have to make do with that. How are the aircraft doing? They're all really chewed up. Oh, there's a crash site up there. Let's airstrike that before we lose the money. I think they just built another base in Central America. Yeah, there's a... oh crap, it's a whole base. Damn. That's gonna be really hard to kill. So it's not just an outpost, it's a base. Uh, have to bring some of my better guys. We're like out of laser weapons too, because I lost all of them. I don't think I can take out the space. Oh, we got easy alien plasma cannons. So that's great. Um, so we can just spread out our scientists here. Yeah, 
gallery. Um, things are looking pretty rough here. How much time is it going to take? Three days for three more suits of wolf battle armor. I really got to take out this base before uh, it's too big of a problem. Um, what I would love is to Where is this alien? It's down there. Just send a couple box shots after it. Let's see if the condors can take it out. I doubt they'll be able to. Let's send two condors. Small plane. Condors are more likely to be able to take this out, so let's go take that out. The interceptor. Let's send our two condors after it. Okay. Uh, yeah, disengage. It's not worth the risks. So that's a... So, go either XCOM 2 or Xenots. I'd say get Xenots. Well, I put it on Borneo because um, Borneo is a bit more useful. So, uh, plasma bolt. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. Oh, uh, you get your laser blaster. Blow shout. Sorry, pal. We lost your precision laser. Uh, am I better putting a ballistics? Sniper in his hands, or just giving him a laser rifle? Mm. I think Ash has good accuracy. Decent reflexes. Can make her a shield. She's got lots of health. Give her a wacky stick. Got laser pistols, I guess. So, oh, thanks for the follow, Super Rosa. Much appreciated. Uh, so let's go with one of these, one of those. So weak. Just can't carry anything. Could do one reload, I guess. Yeah, I might have to make him a riot woman. Okay. <laughs> Just have like no. Very few laser laser weapons left. Young's got his precision laser rifle. Maybe we go with a bunch of shield guys. <laughs> um well, you were uh, you were useful for a while, and then you probably died in a uh, in a breach. Let's, let's go take a look here. Uh, 
when did Super Rosa die? Casualty list is getting longer and longer here. Ah, you you died in our first squad wipe in Dubai. And then uh, just recently we had our second squad wipe. Yeah. Things were going well until uh, this first squad wipe. Then we had a bit of a recovery. And then uh, this recent mission was just an absolute disaster. Um, yeah, you were like you you survived a number of missions, and then uh, and then you didn't. <laughs> you didn't survive the last one. Uh, okay. Let's give you a wacky stick. Give you a laser pistol. I'll give you a shield. I guess we'll we'll also label you a shield. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay. <laughs> Dead Helen wouldn't say a disaster. Yeah, maybe. armor and some of these. Okay. The Briage, you're actually a rifleman. It's a shield that maybe we have glow shout. Give him the basic armor. Give him a ballistic sniper rifle. Just a mid pack, bunch of grenades. And we'll give private, it's a shield, a shield. And a laser pistol. shields. Where do we? Got Dark Young with his laser rifle. Chill. Uh, glow shout. I just don't have the armor. No, we're not going after the alien base. I'm going to... Um, do a small, uh, small mission in the hopes of getting um, getting some more uh, elenium because I I need to uh, I need to have a, a properly kitted out squad if I'm going to uh, attempt that base. Yeah, uh, let's actually reorganize things here.
Okay. So it's got a precision laser, laser rifle, laser rifle, laser pistol, scatter laser. Okay, this is probably okay. Yeah, lots of things would be uh, would be really good, but um, I lack the resources, unfortunately. Let's send the Red Baron out to intercept that. Can you guys do that? Yep. Till and till it's over land. Okay. Okay, we gotta wait for planes to refuel. All right, let's engage this mission. Yeah, getting the bigger dropship would be ideal. So that I could bring more more guys to uh, to the fights. Work our way through the recruit list faster that way. Uh, which, believe it or not, is is not a, a goal of this um, of this run. Working quickly through the uh, recruit list, uh, but it is a uh, unfortunately a reality of the run. <laughs> Okay, so we're dealing with um, the little gray men. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing sending Glow Shout out like this. It's completely unarmed. Uh, Why don't you move up here? Well, okay, we've got a, a farmer with a shotgun to help us. I'm sure he'll be very helpful. A shield, get up here and a voyage. Hmm. 
this feels very exposed out here like that uh... <laughs> Uh, where are you, Dark Young? Up here. I suspect the alien is over here. Let's, uh, let's wait a little bit. Here's our, our local forces friend. Uh, An alien. Last of Poor bastard. Yeah, this is a, a pretty low-level ship we're uh, coming after here. So we're going to take the last mission out on these uh, four saps. sign of them. Young, get up there. Sounds good, Rosa. Thanks for hanging out. Ah, oh, there they are. Uh, Cortez. Back a bit there. Boomer. Shield. Little shit. Get up here. I'll get up here. Young. Oop. Is this guy actually outside? He is, okay. Well, we can't shoot him. So, let's run over here. Get in a decent spot to, uh, Kill him if he comes around the corner. We'll turn uh, Shill over that way. How is Brokey's fleeing? Damn it, how? Coteras, uh... Oh, this 
guy uh, is not overly accurate. Okay, so I can, like, annihilate this guy. But it's probably better to actually kill it with my dudes if I can. But, you know what, let's, let's, just, not, let's just not take any chances. Oh crap, I just destroyed a bunch of cover there. Coward. Actually, let's have Dark Young closer up. We'll put Cool Shout in the back. Yeah, so I could use the tanks as uh, mobile armor, uh, like mobile cover, which um, is probably not a bad idea. Alright. Okay, that's uh, Dark Young has broken and is fleeing. Young, you coward. Shameful display, young. Shameful, shameful display. Uh, let's wait until we have young back here. Pick up your gun, young. Just aliens. Sergeant Dark Young. Yeah, Sergeant Dark Young, why don't you take a shot here? Okay. Fortunately, these guys can't shoot very well. Uh, I can only take the one shot. Debrayage. That guy there. Right. Should I try to capture this guy? Get a shot there. does not seem to be any of these guys at this forte. Um, okay. Alright, I didn't bring any gas grenades. Okay. 
Okay, well, that didn't do a whole lot. Um, okay, the other guy's way back there. Uh, if I blast him, though, we'll lose out on all that. Uh, those nice tech goodies. Maybe I can bait out his reaction shot? No. Okay. Oh, there's another one right there. Get a snapshot at him. No, you can't. Okay. Well, let's use the uh, tank as cover, I guess. Whack them? Yeah, I could run in and whack them. Oh, right, I have my uh, machine gunner. I forgot to bring wacky sticks, though. Yeah, I didn't bring any wacky sticks. Nope, no wacky sticks. <clears throat> in the way. Just gonna murder these guys. Cortez, move your fat ass out of the way. suppressed him. Is it possible to punch these guys? Like if I go in with fists? It is? Slap them down. <laughs> So tempting to just annihilate this guy. That part of the uh, whole point of this was to get uh, resources out of them. You're just going to hit one of our guys there. Ooh. Hang in there, young. Okay. Get him back. There you go. Good job. Uh... This is probably a really bad idea. Are you sure we can punch these guys? <sighs> okay. Blowshout has uh, a suppression grenade. So, in the park. We're gonna keep an eye on him with the. Actually, can the tank come inside? Can. We're gonna keep an eye on him with the tank. Because I don't think he can kill it. 
Will shot's gonna suppression grenade him. And then Uh oh crap, why did I drop the pistol on the ground? And then Voomer and Shill will come in and punch him. Yes, we have. Okay. We're gonna try to punch a psyker. Oh, actually we have a gas grenade. Gas grenade is a lot better. It takes 41 to you. This guy's probably going to drop to a gas grenade. Okay, so he did drop to a gas grenade. So that's a Psyker captured. There appear to be more of them. Probably hiding in the last compartment. Now, where did I put that pistol down? Over here? Crap. Does anyone see the pistol? There it is. Pick up your gun, Shell. Okay. Will shout, get inside. We need your grenades. Young, get inside. Uh, yeah, capturing matters. Um, I think you get more money. Um, also, it gives you um, an advantage on. Um, it gives you a um, a damage boost against the uh, psychers. That too, what Dennis said. So I don't know if there's another one left in here. Let's find out. And then we'll have Glosha bringing up the rear. Let's uh, have a stun grenade ready. Okay, I think this is just a uh, an unarm unarmed guy. A uh, non-combat. I want to see if we can we can slap them down though. Do you just not have enough TU, or is that not actually a thing? Yeah, that was probably a bad idea. Do a single shot. Okay, well, we made a bunch of cash. Uh, Scout Data Core Season Scion. Okay, so. Uh, oh, Dark Young gets a promotion, so it's Glow Shout. And Shill got a promotion. Okay, good. Season Analysis. Oh, and I haven't captured a season yet, so there we go. That's good. base being there. Uh, okay. But we have some more weapons. That's some more alloys, so we can try to make some more weapons. Uh, what do I have the least of? Let's wait until the ship makes it back. I just want to take stock of our guns. Uh, 
Okay. So I've got heavy plasma, I've got uh, la heavy laser, laser sniper, laser rifle, I've got some laser pistols. Maybe, maybe some plasma shotguns. Uh, plasma carbine. Do we have, do we have enough to fully armor our crew now? We do, okay. So I can now fully armor six guys plus a tank. Uh, aircraft. Shrike dropship. I've got the equipment, so let's start that production. Okay. Pull a few guys off of the. Let's actually pull most of our guys off of that wolf armor. We're gonna put more onto the dropship and the carbine. Said I had enough. Okay, we'll have to capture more. Uh, last mission was perfect. We didn't have any casualties, and we took out some uh, some aliens. Uh, but it was against a, uh, a small ship. Based analysis. Uh, teleportation. Da 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 da. The wraith is generally alien beasts. Suddenly from inside the glass, uh, Wraith is distinctly twitchy. It refuses to expose its back to us. Uh, or it's closest to after the whole tank. It approaches simultaneously from a different direction. It will spin in on the spot until they leave for literally hours at a time. Huh. Uh, da 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 da. Preventing them from firing. The surroundings after they made a jump, preventing them from firing their weapons immediately. Okay, so we've done our wraith analysis. Uh, we've got a bit more science. Let's uh, put that into the season analysis. A hero took it. It was. Uh, it's a shield. Yeah, it's a shield. Did the killing shot. Uh, I don't think anyone else made any significant contributions. Oh, uh, Dark Young injured himself, though. So let's, uh, let's take him off the team. Uh, and let's bring in Earl Von Dor open. <laughs> Your middle say otherwise? I guess they do. Oh, wait, no, trust me, you don't get that. Uh, you get that, All right? Okay, we need another uh, research mission. Da, da, da. Okay, cool. We need another relatively small. Uh, okay. Yeah, let's send. Let's send. Yeah, we'll send a foxtrot from being cock up there. Uh, you select a new target, go after that guy. Ooh. Gosh. Uh, select a new target, go after this guy. Mm -hmm. We'll take out those interceptors, I guess. Oh, it's because I have Foxtrots, damn it. They're gonna nuke my, uh... Okay, let's engage. And then I'm just gonna order everyone to retreat at maximum speed. We'll see if we can escape. Seems to have worked. Okay. That may be the new tactic. 
uh, just retreat at maximum speed if um, if I hit a uh, zero percent success thing. Uh, okay, all these guys are nearly refueled. Let's send them out. just so completely outrun by these big ships. Uh, send these guys. Scout UFO. Did I really not capture a scout UFO yet? Oh. Okay. Yes? Okay. So we're gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna just tell everybody to run away. Let's see if that works. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Great. All right, so that's um, that's a good thing to learn. Uh, we can just uh, run away, and we'll be able to to save our aircraft, which is good. I've got plenty of planes. The problem is um, they just can't keep up with them. Quantum Cryptology Center. True, uh, recording our air defense and appropriately cooking the troops of battle. Okay. I guess we'll just dump our science into that stuff. How expensive is this Quantum Cryptology Center? It is very expensive. I could build it, but that's all my money, and it costs fifty grand to uh, to upkeep it. I don't think I can really afford it. What's up, young? Uh, it tells me what the mission of the uh, alien ships are, so that you can better equip your uh, your your squads when you send them up. <laughs> well, since when did I care? Since I I want to to succeed at this uh, at this thing, despite all appearances. Uh, condors. See if you can't take out these interceptors. They're very annoying. Nope. Game says no. Oh, game says yes. Okay. Turn to base. Oh, come on. Uh, all right. Send the fox shots. Uh, I disagree. I don't think that's really the problem here, young. Okay, so we're we're going to have to do this one. This is a suicide mission, basically. So it has a zero percent chance. So we we're gonna try to um, 
fly in and take out the bomber. We're not expecting these guys to survive. Great. Okay, so that will... So that saved the terror attack. Uh, I lost the ships, but I prevented the terror the terror attack. Uh, so that is worth it in my opinion, uh, versus losing North America. Although we're gonna lose North America anyway. Fuck. Uh, okay. We're doing badly there. Hmm. That was an aer aerial terror mission, Tarkim, so it's not an actual uh, base assault. It's not a, like an actual ground mission. Uh, okay, so we've completed season analysis. Gosh, we're we're losing regions here. Did we we finished any of this stuff? No. Buzzer jumpsuit. Cool. I don't think I'll actually be using any buzzer jumpsuits, but uh Need to have. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm waiting on the. Um, um, I'm waiting to attack it until I have some more some more guns. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna fire some of my scientists. I don't really want to, but I don't have, uh, I don't have any research projects on the go. Let's not actually do it. We're almost done. Actually, do I even need the wolf battle armor? I don't actually need that wolf battle armor right now. Let's pull those guys off of that project, put them on the plasma carbine. <sighs> Planes are repaired, great. So there's another, so alien base is the second step of uh, of the bases. It goes outpost, base, fortress. Um, and uh, I'm pretty sure the base I did take out was, was actually a, an outpost. Um, we managed it, but with a team that was fully kitted out. Uh, yeah, so our North American forces, Air Force, is completely destroyed. Um, so that's great. When you select a new target, go after that guy. You might actually capture them. And the aliens are just flying circles around us. Let's 
just take it out. Return to base. God. 12% chance of victory. With three aircraft. Yeah, probably Leverington. Hmm. I don't think with myself engaging this, I have much of a better chance. Unless I suicide into the landing ship, and then I can, uh, I can intercept it with a squad, and maybe get more uh, Illinian and stuff, which will let me upgrade stuff. Right, let's let's go with that. Uh, we'll have the fox trots. Well, actually, we'll just have everything target there. Yeah, I think alien tech jumped ahead uh, faster than uh, my own tech. Okay, so we did take out the uh, we took out the uh, landing ship. Uh, it cost us our planes for some time, uh, but. I, I needed to take that out. To always win those engagements? Uh, I haven't... Uh, I was not, uh, not aware of that. Uh, okay. So let's... Let's get this squad sorted out. Heavy weapons, goal shout. You're supposed to be a sniper, I think. Uh, can be a sniper. Let's actually just double check what is everyone supposed to be. Uh, so Dibriage. Uh, where are you? Dibriage 2, you're supposed to be a sniper. Will Shadow is supposed to be a sniper. How is it supposed to be heavy weapons? Voomer is supposed to be a rifle. Uh, Earl Von Door open. Uh, it's supposed to be grenades. So let's make that a shield. And it's a shield. It's obviously supposed to be a shield. Uh, okay. So, we get a heavy uh, laser weapon. That's you sorted out. Glow shout. Which of you is the better sniper? Glow shout, you're the better sniper. So, you get this. grenades instead. And the voyage, you're going to be a not an assault, a rifleman. We'll give you this laser rifle. Couple rounds. Give you armor. God, you're weak, de voyage. Okay. Gotta get stronger. Uh, okay. Boomer wanted to shoot a uh, rifle. But I'm tempted to give him a shield since I actually have laser shields for him. Uh, laser, uh, laser pistols for him. No 
little bit of time. This is going to have to do. Still have that plasma carbine. So let's, uh, oh, let's make sure we rearrange things on the plane. Uh, Euristo has never, did not submit a soldier, so there is no Euristo. with the Red Baron. Yeah, Euristo, I guess, is uh, too cowardly to fight for Earth. <laughs> I mean, who will be around to tell us whether things are a puzzle or not? <laughs> Excellent, Lovington. That's the kind of attitude we need on the Baronauts. Oh, okay. So we are dealing with Androns. Sure, take that shot. Missed. Okay. Down. Our old bond door open, get over here. Out. Should be okay there. It's a shield. Uh, <clears throat> come use the dubious cover of the uh, bus stop. And the bridge, get over here. Okay. What? That's really bad. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that is atrociously bad. to use it gonna take you to throw that god also useless hmm. 
<sighs> yeah, they um, certainly not seeming worth it at the moment. Have any grenades? No. Do you have grenades? Not the right kind. Mm. Nope. How's gonna die? Chances zero percent. Let's try that. That might save how. Mm -hmm. Low shout. I don't know where to put you. Still 100% block here. Well, he's probably gonna walk around this and then just one shot you. Please kill that. Great, good job, pal. And little known military blunder. Uh gee. What is a little known military blunder I could uh discuss? Think about it for a bit. Uh, Televisota? Don't know that one. Uh, can you get a shot on? Let's see, a little known military blunder. Well, um, he did a great, did start a number of uh, wars that ended up going quite poorly for Russia. Um, so I don't know if you would necessarily call them complete blunders, but he started a number of, uh, actually him and his predecessors started a number of wars with Sweden that they, uh, that they promptly lost for, uh, great costs in blood and uh, and money um, so I don't know if you would consider those a little known but um, it's the best one I got <laughs> um, yeah I mean I'm I mean there would be a number of them from the Napoleonic campaigns uh, Okay, this thing didn't uh, kill us somehow. Well, take a shot. Great job. Uh... Hmm. 60%, surely you can do that. Okay, do it again. A 
Will shout. Uh, yeah, move up here. 32. It should leave you with enough to hide back behind cover. So that's 71% shot. Great. Um, hide back here. Well, General Winter was uh, very useful in the Napoleonic Wars as well. Um, so when, like after Napoleon attacked, as the, as the Russians, how did he tank a hit from that? But the tank just got blown up in one shot. Uh, um, So yeah, like the um, the Russians were allied with uh, Austria and Prussia against uh, Napoleon. Great, killed it. Um, and there were a number of battles where you know you'd have uh, three armies against Napoleon, and they almost lost every single one of those kind of battles. Um, largely because they were terrible at coordinating. Um, and the Germans, the Germans kept doing stupid things like charging Napoleon and piecemeal and stuff like that. Um, so probably, I can't remember the name of the exact engagement, but there were a number of times when, um, you know, one of these coalition forces would, would show up and, um, you know, someone would pointlessly charge and then, uh, and then die. Um, so that's not a great answer, but that's, that's all I got for you. Um, so I'm not, uh, I'm not big on, um, like military history in terms of like, you know, specific engagements. Um, I, mean, I guess there were a number of, um, like, I know some well-known blunders. Um, the, the most famous one is when uh, the Russians sent their Baltic fleet around the world to fight the Japanese. That was uh, a pretty enormous blunder. Uh, so they sent the Baltic fleet all the way around the world, and then uh, it was promptly uh, annihilated the moment it showed up. In the Russo-Japanese War, yeah. Um, but um, you know that's like pretty well the one of the best-known military blunders ever. So um, not sure that really counts as a lesser-known one. Uh, okay, so let's patch uh, patch them up. Somehow tanked a, uh, a hit from uh, that plasma cannon. Um, I mean, there were probably a, few, a number of um, military blunders. Um, the thing about the Russians, they often had um, not bad generals, especially in the Imperial era. Um, but they, their overall strategic situation was just awful like technologically backwards they didn't have uh, like bad gear oh really see I didn't know uh, I didn't know that exactly um, from what I from what I understood of the engagement was that the um, the Japanese had more modern uh, warships with um, like full complements of long range uh, weaponry. Whereas the Russians had uh, like a very outdated style of ship, which had a, like a mixture of calibers of guns. So you'd have some long range guns, some short range guns. Yeah, I mean, Russia has the strategic weapons that. Ooh. Okay. Let's 
So I think there's a an alien in here. Or at least a robot. Uh, can we? Is this all the same building? Looks like it is. Yeah, so, you know, the Japanese being a relatively new power had ac actually had, um, cause even, even just a few years prior, um, the Japanese would have been, uh, hopefully outdated compared to the Russians, but, um, they very quickly industrialized is, uh, is my understanding. Um, and we're able to do so, um, to the point that they were probably, they probably had a more developed economy than the Russians did. Uh, well, actually, they almost certainly had a more developed economy than the Russians did. All that's to say, uh, I unfortunately don't know that much about uh, specific military engagements. <laughs> I'm sure there are many, many examples from uh, World War II where, uh, you know, the Soviets did uh, very ill-advised offenses and stuff. Oh, hello, alien ship. Let's just close that door. Uh, yeah, I think we found the alien ship. Uh, what's my opinion on the current, uh, current precedent? Hmm, opinion on Putin. Oh! <laughs> Lovely. Oh my God. <laughs> well, aliens know we're here as well. <laughs> uh, do you get to shoot back? No. You probably also don't get to shoot back. Hide behind cover. Are they behind us? No. Uh... Okay. I think they are behind us. Oh, look at that. There they are. Get him back with a grenade? 100% block. Concussion grenade, get him. to concussion grenade him. That did nothing. Great. Um, crap, 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 crap. What do we do? Vote for reaction shots. The voyage is probably going to die. Just teleports away. Okay. We'll take that. Okay, how you need to heal yourself. Uh, right, so opinion on the current Russian president. Um, what do we say? Um, He's a fairly impressive guy, um, not in a, like, wow, he's so good, like, I, I wish we had people like him. No, he's he's quite horrible. Um, 
but um, you know he he is also extremely effective. Um, and he he's not afraid to get his hands dirty and do what it takes to uh, to get what he wants, um, which you know is pretty obvious, you know with the. Uh, 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 with all the, uh, you know, poisonings of political opponent opponents and stuff like that. Um, he's, he's very concerned with, like, uh, hard power, hard strategic assets. Um, under his, um, under his kind of rule, he's, um, he's concentrated a lot of strategic industry back under control of the Russian state. Um, and which has preserved a lot of kind of like in military industrial um, industry and so on in Russia. They've done it through a lot of kind of uh, less than legal means, you could say. Um, and they think they've definitely increased the power. He's definitely managed to increase the power of the Russian state. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. I, I mean, um, uh, yeah, I mean, like, he, sure, that's a big part of it. Um, but, he, he, you know, he's also done a lot of um, quite effective things, I would say. Um, I mean, he's a, um, he's definitely like blood, uh, a pretty murderous guy. Um, but, um, you know, he's no, he's no like Yeltsin. Um, he has, uh, managed to kind of bring a certain level of pride back to uh, to Russia. Um, something which I'm sure uh, a number of the Russians we see in like uh, in like the DDR Jake Discord would possibly disagree with. Um, but it's um, it's something or at least they would think it's stupid, which maybe they're right, but uh, Yeah, and that's um, that's that's something Putin understands very well, and is not afraid. Where did that come from? Uh, is not afraid to implement. Uh. Oh yeah, I know he could teleport. I just had no idea where he was. Uh, I thought I could see up this hallway. Man. Where the heck is it? Oh, he went up to the second floor. Bastard. Can we kill him? they're not too uh they're not too tough uh okay. <laughs> uh yeah i mean i doubt the russians are uh where the, the Putin government is going to be uh, inviting me to the Valde Club any anytime soon or anything. Uh, the Valde Club is a um, it's like a meeting of academics that um, discusses 
problems facing Russia and stuff like that. Ooh, there's another one of those. Oh, sure. I I'm not saying it's the worst regime ever or anything. Um, and I think um, especially what is going on? Um, yeah, and I think the a lot of like kind of the American media's portrayal of Russia is uh, particularly shrill. Oh yeah, uh, would not want to be uh, an opposition guy in uh, in Russia. Okay. Run away. Zap him. Okay. Good. There's another one. He's over there. Okay. Maybe uh, just take a peek around. Nothing. Ooh. What are we seeing? Okay, we're seeing these guys through the windows. Yeah, there's very few periods in Russian history when you would want to be uh, a opposition person. <clears throat> the possible exception of um, of uh, the Brezhnev era, the late Brezhnev era, and then maybe under Yeltsin. Um, but under Yeltsin, you didn't so much have to worry about the Russian state as uh, mafia guys coming to kill you. That's another thing that um, you know people don't uh, necessarily give Putin a lot of credit for. Um, he did manage to more or less like stop the um, the like blatant uh, mafia running of things. So I can definitely understand how he uh, how he gets a lot of support. Yeah, it's definitely more to do with because he wanted the power for himself, and he want he. It wasn't a like moral thing, like oh, mafia is bad and corruption, the rule of law is important. No, it's because um, he saw it as weakening the state. Um, got an alien. A robot over here. Okay. Yeah, I could blow up the engine, that might kill it. Yeah, you know what? I'm just going to try to explode this engine. Well, you get to say that in a safely non-dictatorial country. Yeah, you just have to have one of those good benevolent dictators. Of which we have so many historical examples. Uh, okay. Ah, come on. Okay. Uh. 
Okay. <laughs> if we actually killed it. Also, is there another one in here? Okay, there are not. And why don't you run up over here, glow shot. Oh dear. a favor of exposing himself. Great. Uh... Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I feel that might be a different context, though, Young. and Corporal to shield through. Oh, to a room that's on fire. Excellent. Uh, well, at least it's clear of aliens for now. through the other one too? Why not? Let's send you through the other one as well. Okay. Uh, yeah, there may be another squad wipe coming. So I saw a couple of them over here. Uh-huh. No, this is just a, uh, a landing ship. Have a stun grenade. Can you, can you close the door, Shill? You can. Great. Uh, you shut that door as well. So we saw him over here. There might be. Well, I know there's at least two up here. Okay, there's another one. Yeah, I hate these rooms. They're the worst. Okay. Sweet. I think there's just the two of them. I'm going to set up how... and... glow shot. To 
take a shot out this door. Okay, how? That's a lot of blocks in the way. Is this worth it? Do I have a an EMP grenade by any chance? No. It's just the aliens. I don't think that's gonna kill it or anything. If I shoot at him, he's gonna get a reaction shot too. There's just a lot of cover in the way. Let's take a shot. Okay. It's a shield. Uh, let's not take a shot. I want you to be able to close the door. <laughs> Thank you, Merrick. Much appreciated. Great. Okay, we killed it. It's at least one of them down. Wouldn't even uh, suppress this as shield. This is great. Okay. Shield, come over here. Uh, let's reload your gun. Set you up over in this corner. How over here? Shield, open the door. Oh, uh, uh, first the voyage. Why don't you try to soften them up a bit? Uh, hmm. Sure. Okay, got a hit. Can you get a shot on him? No. You hopped over like so. Now he takes a reaction shot. Okay. Uh, 27, 34. Yeah, okay, we'll do. Oh boy. Uh, she'll close that door, please. Let's reload. Um, yeah, why don't you crouch? Pass another turn. Okay. Alright, he's more or less in the same spot. Great. First, we'll shoot with this guy. Hit him. <laughs> Got him. Oh no, we haven't won yet. Okay. Uh, did we kill them all? Are there more on the ship? Well, we've killed all the ones on the ship, uh, so let's just uh, capture the ship. And we'll, uh, we'll just take that as a win. We just gotta wait it out. Great. All right. Mission successful. 
Casualties are bad, but uh, look at that, 127 grand. Oh yeah, Boomer got back up. Amazing. All right, so we only we only lost um, Boomer's doppelganger. Um. Okay, so there's one one robot running around. Let's see, what did Howie get? Military cross, uh, order of merit for killing ten extraterrestrial. He got five kills. Dang. Uh, wonderful. Okay. Landing ship data core. So this is the first time capturing a landing ship. Look at all that money we got for plasma batteries. So for five and, uh, it's 10 total. What about the military cross in a single operation? Yeah. So how we kill five, five aliens in a single mission. But look at that dosh. So much money. Okay. Yeah, Londor up and uh, kicked it. Um, can't remember where door open died. I think he got shot in the back by that um, teleporting guy. New projects, alien armor plating. Sure. Let's uh, let's get on that. How much to repair the car? Uh, let's see. 120k and lots of my resources uh i think we will not be uh, replacing the tank uh i'm gonna go with uh i'm gonna switch over to just troopers but i think i need more engineers everything i just made from that fight exactly so um I'm going to focus on armoring and kitting out my guys uh, more effectively. Oh yeah, I have to wait for the, uh, the dropship to come back. Yeah, these guys are all beat up. Ugh, my, uh, my Air Force is a shambles. It keeps... Um, we keep losing... Uh, having our aircraft downed, so then I can't respond to the uh, all these UFOs flying around. Yeah, it would be nice. Uh, that sounds nice, Jake. Yeah. Uh, speaking of, I should probably... If I want to prepare for the base raid, I should probably hire more guys. Because right now I only have nine nine soldiers that are not dead. Uh, uh, so... Yeah, I'm going to have to bring in... I'm going to have to bring in more meat. Because uh, we don't have we don't have the manpower anymore. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How are my aircraft doing? Yeah, they're all they're all banged up. We're we just not. I'm not getting that tech I need for the next level aircraft. It takes so long to uh, develop this gear. 300k per Corsair. I don't even have 300k right now. Hmm. I don't have any jackals. Um, I never actually developed jackal armor. I went straight to wolf armor. Hey, Shil, how you doing? Uh, it's a shield is doing well. OK. 
hire some more engineers, I guess. Uh, okay. We're going to do some lazy hiring here. I'm going to start by bravery. And... Okay, so we'll take these guys. And when they arrive, I'm just going to rename them and use uh, whatever stats they have. Air Force is just shredded. It's going to take forever for them to come back. about the planes in uh, North America. Planes in North America are, are all downed. Uh, Asian planes can go out again soon-ish. I think I'm going to have to bite the bullet and build at least a Corsair. With no free hangar slots. Really. Oh, it's because I'm building the uh, the Shrike dropship. Intercept, no planes. It's going to take forever for them to get patched up. Could intercept this guy. Except all the planes are pretty chewed up. Yeah, I don't think they they survive if I intercept it. Ugh. Uh, forecasted change. Mine's six hundred and forty six K. Yeah, I'm going to lose North America. Just terrible. Looks like I lose Africa. Keep Indochina. Keep the Soviet Union. We're close to losing Europe. It's pretty grim. I don't think there's much I can do about it. Three incoming, yeah. The tricky thing is, I don't, uh, I don't entirely know. I mean, not getting squad wipes would help. Using rocket launchers, yeah, that would probably help. Might help. Uh, okay, so we got more soldiers. We got more engineers. Um, let's pump them into both these projects. Oh, right. Uh, okay, so we finished that plasma carabine. Let's make some more suits of pull. More suits of armor. Okay, where are shields here. Alright, these guys are getting it named after folks in chat, and they're getting uh, whatever stats they have. This will be Freaky Name 3, I think. No, th yeah, this is Freaky Name 3. Uh, Itsuko Ito will be Vesna 2. So I think that's Frankie Vesna. Frankie Vesna 2. Uh, this one will be... Group Eric uh, 3. Uh, Hartman will be Eric Ran 3. Because Kusera will be EDR 
Jake three. Here we go. We needed more meat. Okay. Uh, I was a little banged up too. <laughs> I give them red shirts. I can't. Sadly, I can't give them red shirts. If I could, I would. Uh, just don't have the cash for a Corsair. That money is just bleeding away. Alien armor plating. Uh, but we can now produce these hard materials uh, to cook them with our own designs. Great. Ah, we get assault shields now. Well, well we can research assault shields. Yeah. We're going to have to send them in to harden up. Okay, planes are coming back online. Uh, but not enough of them. Let's wait a little bit. They tend to come in clusters. I'm not sure. I haven't had anyone survive past Captain. So, <laughs> I don't know. Um, many of my soldiers have not, uh, not exactly had, uh, long careers. Um... Okay. Alright, let's try to intercept this guy. Oh. But the planes are all too beat up. I can't. Okay, well, we'll knock that out. Okay. Could intercept this with a dropship. Are those pesky interceptors right there? You know, fortune favors the bold. I think. Look at that, everyone's in, in good shape here. Oh, why don't you come along? Yeah, we'll just bring the uh, bring as many along as we can. Don't have wolf armor for everyone. Although I have wolf armor for almost everyone. Just poor SS doesn't get armor. Yeah, all the money uh, has disappeared into these uh, these projects. Okay. Let's spare lasers. Let's go laser pistol on him. The young's accuracy is really high. What about Glow Shout? Glow Shout's accuracy is worse. So, Young, you get the sniper rifle. Uh, hello, Young, you gotta hit the gym. Come on, buddy. Oh, yeah, you keep that heavy machine gun. Hmm. I don't know what to give Glow Shout. Could. So glow shouts got better accuracy, I think, than it did. Yeah. So let's give glow shout the laser rifle. 
Uh, okay. Who do I make my assault guy? Deb's got really good reflexes, so let's give them the plasma assault to assault gun. And yeah, that uh, that ship's going to be well. The, the ship I'm about to send these guys out against is going to be intact, so we're going to have a full squad of guys to worry about. Assess you're getting a rocket launcher. Uh, okay. Yeah, barcode. Let's actually make you a shield. And should have a few grenades. Okay. Yeah, I guess we're going to have to give you a ballistic rifle. I'd rather give them grenades or more refills. Let's give them some grenades. We'll give them one of these and I think one of those. Okay. Alright, what else we got here? Actually, I do need another shield, so why don't we make you a shield? That way I can give you a laser pistol. Actually, we'll change your roll to shield so I can more easily tell at a glance. I'll give you that wolf armor. I've already got that. Give you a laser pistol. God, so weak. Okay, so we got two shields, heavy weapons. Sniper, another sniper. Okay, yeah, but you're actually a rifleman, so let's switch your role so I can. Yeah. Uh, gives two extra slots. Each uh, upgraded uh, dropship gives two extra slots. I think that's all right. Okay. All right. Yes, and the door layout is quite a bit different. I only have one heavy weapon. Maybe I want to make one of these shield guys. Um, like maybe I'd rather give one of these shields a heavy machine gun instead. Even though it's a ballistic weapon, the heavy machine guns do decent damage. <clears throat> so I'm worried I'm not going to have enough killing power. Uh, yeah, we'll give Barcode a heavy machine gun. Alright, let's go for it. And then... I 
Let's see if we get away with it. Looks like we're getting away with it. Uh, send the condors. Oh no! <laughs> oh, I should have run. Should have run. <sighs> God. That just killed so many troops. I lost my two captains, of course. Uh... Do I get the gear back at least? I get their gear back. God. All oh, these replacement guys are so terrible. Probably a uh, a new base out this way. Oh, well, maybe not. Okay. <sighs> Yay! We have a Shrike drop shit. Uh, okay, let's. to decommission this guy. <sighs> so at least we can head out again. Just immediately. Should I build a Corsair Acceptor? I think I should. Well, we'll see this through. Not going to be running away. If it takes an Earth 3, it'll take an Earth 3, but we're going to we're going to win this game on this difficulty. Okay. Everything in Belcat's tree is destroyed. Yep, nothing that could intercept it. Well, maybe two fox shots from the barony. Take it out. They're almost at 100% health. Let's send these guys out. Ooh, okay. Yeah, disengage. I'm not taking a 10% chance. Did I lose the armor from those guys? It doesn't look like I did. So I at least have armor. Well, let's see what happens at the turn of the month here. <laughs> I could just lose if I... Uh, if a bunch of the regions... Uh, yeah, there goes North America. Oh, we lost 500k funding. We lost Southern Africa as well. Yeah, I think we're screwed. Can't pay payments and wages. Ugh, things were looking so okay. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, we've made it further than Earth 1. Uh, Alright, well. I think we ought to have a, uh, a charge of the light brigade. Uh, 
Let's uh, have Dennis Wolf 3. And this one can be. Well, let's see who else has been in chat. This can be Empower 2. I think we've only had uh, 2. Mm, scroll up your chat. Uh, uh, Empower Grand. Mm. All right, let's go back to my list. And <laughs> we'll have Romateo three, oh, two. And then Zinya de Ben we'll have as a uh, of Williams to you. There we go. Uh, yeah. Well, let's um, let's see if we can't take out the uh, alien base. We'll, we'll wait for our uh, our beaten up vet veterans to heal up, and then we'll we'll try to take out that alien base. Is it, uh, yeah, fill that up until it's over land. Right. So we can Yeah. Okay, well part of the trouble is a lot of these successful interceptions I'm getting, they're still knocking out my uh my air force for uh, for quite a while. I think they do. Um, so, well, Soviet Union and North America provide the most funding. I'm not entirely sure, Dennis. I think if um, I think if you're really good at them, yes. Um, but they're pretty tricky. Well, I don't know. Like, I, I'm not. Uh, I'm not sure how to do it. Uh, so we could send out uh, a large one. Yeah, maybe I should have built more Corsairs. Ah, crap. Okay. Everybody run. Although this seem... Manually telling your guys to run away seems to be more effective. Because you can actually just uh, tell them to run away, and then they run away. Okay. Oh, I don't think I have anything actually equipped on the Red Baron too. These guys are still a little beat up. Oh, and the actual bases, yeah.
Uh, oh crap. Oh, Alright, they're leaving me alone. Let you guys go back to base. Now we have a foxtrot down. Might be able to take that out. Nope, return to space. Okay, has everybody healed up? Not yet. Yeah, it takes a while for them to heal up. Well, we're gonna have to take some. some raw troops in. Well, it looks like we're going to have to take a lot of raw troops in. This doesn't seem wise to just take a whole squad of uh, riots into battle. Probably better off waiting until everyone's healed up. Let's just wait till everyone's healed up. Wait, hang on. So you're telling me the missile bases will shoot down... Will shoot down the uh, aliens? Spill rocket launcher or lay detectors into the bases, sit down some alien ships. Ah, uh, they only shoot incoming base attacks. Okay. Yeah, that's what I thought. I've only had a single base attack. Ever. Maybe that happens later on. I don't know. Where you get more of them. Are my... Oh, my troopers. Okay, great. Everyone's healed up. So let's, uh, let's take a few of these privates off here. Got to bring all our best people on this. Uh, let's leave Jake behind. Uh, okay. Okay. Get as many of them. In the armor as I can. In Xenonauts, it definitely says that it only affects uh, base attacks. Uh, okay. So the Bibliage, you're an assault. So let's give you that plasma assault. And we're giving you well armor. It is a rifleman, so let's give you a laser rifle. And we'll toss a couple grenades on you. Let's 
do a concussion grenade instead. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I would definitely um, use a lot of towers if uh, if it worked like that. Trust row. Hmm. Let's switch Chasro over to heavy weapons. We'll go on a scatter laser. And oh, a couple of random grenades. There we go. It's a shield. You get a shield. It's gonna be a laser pistol. I'm gonna give you some grenades too. Put those and let's say a quick gash grenade. Nope, I uh, I can't do anything uh, with this much death. So all I can do is uh, shoot down. Um, Shoot down alien aircraft and uh, hope for the best, basically. But I'm, uh, I'm probably in a a funding spiral at the moment. Shield, I guess. Gonna be pretty trash. Frankie. I'm gonna need all the killing power I can get, so I'm gonna go with uh, some heavy machine guns. Ricky name two. Uh, let's give you a heavy machine gun as well. Okay. So we've got one sniper, one guy with an assault plasma, we've got a rocketeer. You're gonna have one guy without armor. Well, we got two guys without armor. It's pretty grim. Uh, there's only the one exit, I think, right? Or do they exit from the front and the back on these? I think they exit from the front and back. It's not really going to matter, because, uh, because, yeah, things, uh, things are going so poorly. Well, let's, uh, let's see if we can't win this base assault. I mean, why not? We're, uh, we're losing region after region here. Yeah, we're about to lose Europe. So, if I somehow manage to win this base assault, we might uh, we might be able to uh, make money back. Just not so sure we're going to be uh, winning this base assault. <laughs> right. Let's 
on Dark Young. Actually, maybe. Uh, so we're going to go out this door. is going to be there to open the door. And good voyage. And the freaky name. You guys are watching the back door. I guess along with Merrick. And SS, be ready with that rocket launcher. We get the spooky nighttime music for uh, base assaults. Okay. here. Right, uh, let's move on up. It's a ship. <laughs> Chalcero, can you make it over here? You can. Frankie Vesna, how about you hop over like so? Boomer. Up here. Access. Uh, you get a move on over here. I'll send a Riage back. Freaky name, come back here. And shoot the Merrick. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Here. It's a shield. I should come uh, do some exploring for us. Okay, so there's another door there. Voyage, crouch down. SS can come over here. Okay. So we've got Androns. Can you shoot this? We're really badly placed to shoot this. I didn't realize this uh, this ship blocks so much. <laughs> yeah, I feel bad for everyone who has to rely for uh, on Dark Young to provide cover. Yeah, the trouble is um, the uh, despite appearances, the ship is actually blocking uh, our line of fire. Uh, 
Uh, Arkran, do you have anything? Nope. Just a pistol. You still gonna be able to shoot there? No. Boomer, why don't you come around like that? Shoot Merrick, you can at least take a bullet if you have to. Uh, percent blocked. Can I at least move him to a spot where he will be able to do something next turn? Probably gonna come through and throw a grenade at us. Let's see what happens. Uh, Shields in some trouble. Well, hello. Shield, do you have anything useful on you? Nope. Maybe assess can save you though. <laughs> Took a direct hit from a rocket. Still standing, okay. Uh oh. Okay, well you deserve to die, Shell. Those are two good shots. Um you still can't shoot there. You can shoot there now. How's your shield doing? Your shield is doing sort of okay. Let's crouch behind it. Uh huh. Young can make it over here and take a snapshot, I guess. Kill it. Get out of line of sight. Is anyone else available who could maybe save the day for Shill? Boomer can run over here. Can you get more out of the way? You can. Nope. Yeah, they, uh, they tank hits way better than uh, my actual tank, <laughs> which, is, uh, which is great. Trussero, if you could reaction fire when the alien pops up, that'd be great. Uh, Merrick, why don't you take cover? Okay, so that guy's got a bomb again. Okay. Well, we just did a ton of damage to them, so that's good. Boomer. God damn it, Boomer. Let's uh, reload that. Uh, oh, thanks for the gift sub, Merrick. That's very kind of you. Is this gonna get Aircran killed? Yeah, it's just that's just gonna get Aircran killed. Uh let's let's fall back. Deb, 
Get a little, a little closer. And plasma cannon's a blast weapon. So I don't really want to clump my guys up too much, but yeah, he doesn't get, even get a snap. Good job, guys. Oh, great job. Oh god, that's a third one. <laughs> okay, Debriage has uh, taken some hits. We're going to see if he can't kill it. Well, actually, maybe I should take the shots over here first. Ooh, 55 damage. Good job. Uh, Sergeant Debriage. Uh, yeah, give it a go, Pirate of Charles Rail. Okay, we suppressed our guys, but I think it's okay. Uh, why don't you. Uh, Take a peek on what's up there. Young, can you shoot this thing? Yeah. How about you, uh, SS? Can you shoot this thing? No. Can shoot. Did we kill it? I think we killed it. Nice. Uh, okay. Yeah, uh, yeah. You guys stay there. needs medical attention. Does anyone have anything? Did I forget to bring a med pack? Oh my gosh. Debriage, do you have a med pack? No. Does no one have a med pack? Oh no, I didn't bring a med pack. Oh. Uh, oh, what a disaster. <laughs> yeah, temporary emergency navigation. Um, okay, my only my only hope is Maybe, maybe there's a med pack on what's left of Shill. I, uh, yeah, I really brought zero med packs on a base mission. Not my best decision. Uh, but I'm not exactly known for good decisions, so. Gotta stay on brand, you know? Okay. But you guys, uh, you keep an eye on it. <laughs> yeah, maybe the aliens bring uh, medical gear. Okay. Yep. The voyage is still slowly bleeding out. Shill, did you have a med kit? Nope. Shill did not have a med kit. Lovely. Okay, well, let's make the most of the voyage while we can. Uh, 
man. <laughs> Just <laughs> rub some lizard man corpses on me. Yeah. Well, we somehow win this. Um, maybe Dev will get back up from, from the blood loss. Oh, hello. Dev, use that. Uh... Good job, Dev. I wonder if the actual room types, um, like, mean anything in the uh, alien bases. So, know when they do a base assault on on you, the um, the base that's generated generated is based off of like what you've actually built. Yeah, I know it changes, but I don't know. Like, does it? Like, is there an equivalent of a? Um, like, is there an equivalent of an alien? Like crew quarters or something? Oh. Bring more gas grenades to save low health soldiers? Oh, so if I knock them out, they don't die? Interesting. Uh, well, the voyage is at one health. So she's about to die. I could use her as a scout. Yeah, I mean, if I win the mission, that's a, that's a pretty big if. Oh, aha, there's an alien over there. That's uh, going to take 48 to shoot. So... Let's... Uh, These things explode? Oh, well, that's good. The ones tall, the tall ones by the wall. These explode? Hmm. That's good to know. gas grenades. No. Or smoke grenades? No. Okay. Not that I have those. I know there's another one over here somewhere. Taser stick? I don't I don't think these guys are gonna go down to taser sticks. No. 
a freaking get over here. Frankie, keep an eye out. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, good thing he missed. Just goes down. Man, I don't think we're winning this mission. There he is. Yeah, but like I don't, I don't really have cover to use. Course breaks and runs. Always in a pointless direction. <sighs> Freaky has a useless amount of uh, TU. Oh boy. Good job, Merrick. America, America managed to survive somehow. Okay. All right. Well, that's uh, one of them down. Uh, how about you get out of that line of sight there, uh, Aircraft? Yeah, but you're bleeding, so you'll you'll die. Uh, you'll slowly bleed out. Um, It's broken and it's fleeing. Yeah. You know, the decency to turn around. Let's see what you can see, young. Are you able to? Oh no, that's not cover. It's not cover at all. Oh, you're so dead, freaky. Okay. Uh, pick that up. Get out of the way. Hopefully. Hey, he missed. Great. Uh, 
Nightmare who has bled out. Okay, Ricky. Great job, Ricky. Uh, Erkren, you can't even fire that gun. Okay. Oh, did that actually kill... Oh, no, okay, it didn't kill Frankie, does it? He's right here. Can you make it behind some cover? Sort of. <laughs> yeah, I think the uh, disaster... Things are getting more and more disastrous, Jake. Um... We are um, we're on the cusp of Earth three, uh, I could say. <laughs> Is it Hollywood sequel? Yes. Yeah, it will. Uh, it will have all the classics, all all the hits. Can even with a fresh turn. Frankie can't fire a shot. God, you're useless, Frankie. Okay. Can you give him cover? With 100% work on it, yeah. Uh, no? Okay. There's a big scary robot around here somewhere. I should go pick up that plasma gun. Oh boy. How did you get there? Uh, excellent amount of damage. Yeah, you're not getting a shot. Oh dear. You're just gonna die if you run out there. Maybe this guy had a laser weapon? A rifle. Okay, well, it's better than nothing, I guess. Uh, great grand set up here. Okay, well, there goes freaky name. Yeah, well, you, uh, we we were lacking in uh, in gear. Uh, okay. Excellent. Um, young. Can you save Frankie Vesna? You can. Good job, young. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah. I um, I will be picking them up. Actually. Oh. Hello. Young, yeah, do you think you could shoot that? It's not too much trouble. You have a single shot. Let's let's make it count. Okay. Now run away. Uh. <laughs> Yeah, we don't get to burst fire there. Fifty-five percent chance, oh, nineteen percent chance to hit three shots. 
How much TU will I have yeah, left? Enough to run behind some cover. So let's do it. Okay. Um, you need 32 to be able to shoot. Okay, so you're, you're incapable of shooting. Maybe we'll run you around like here, uh, in case it comes over this way. Uh, that can be your answer. Young just ate uh, plasma cannon shot. We're, we're about to uh, lose this campaign. We'll be going to Earth 3 pretty soon. There's no pickup or... Uh, Yeah, they're... I mean, they're overburdened with... He apparently can't even reload. Ooh, Jesus. Uh, young... Keep running away. Young is going to bleed out and die. Yeah, we didn't need them. If people got shot, they were, they were already dead. Uh, where did it go? Oh, there it is. Young, maybe you can avenge your killer. Oh, good job, Young. Run, you run over here, get that um, plasma carbine. Okay. Does this um, scatter laser is not doing us much good? Out of TUs, great. Well, Young is soon to bleed out. He may die right now. No, he's somehow still alive. Okay. Bring that pulse grenade. Yeah, you're already dead. Yeah. Again. Sadly. Uh, okay. Young, you're gonna die really soon. Why don't uh, you come find out what's over here for us? Probably dead. Yeah, he's dead. Okay. Okay, Eric Erkrin and Frankie. It's our last two guys. Oh, can't do a snapshot. Great. Oh, this is going very poorly. I actually had uh, semi decent hopes at the start of the. Uh, at the start of the stream today, I thought we would have a uh, a shot at uh, maybe recovering, but 
Nope, not to be. Um, so for those joining, we're, <clears throat> uh, we have negative $400,000 on the campaign map, and we have lost, uh, two continents, uh, North America and, um, which other one did we lose? Uh, South Africa. But losing uh, North Africa is a pretty, uh, losing North America is a pretty heavy blow. Uh, yep, we don't have anything. We just have a stun grenade. Good jump behind some cover, I guess. Let's try jumping behind cover. See if that uh, does us any good. American. Oh, tank that shot. Yeah, this is a base assault. Oh, Vesna took hardly any damage there. Good job, Vesna. Uh, you you can really take a bullet. Um, so we get to have a snapshot. This campaign did have one successful base assault. Um, yeah, two wounded privates. Um, at least they have decent gear. just need to keep pressing pressing onwards the uh, spooky music certainly doesn't help in here, but we're going to find out. Okay. Well, we found a radar room. There's a door there. Perfect. Oh, gosh. <laughs> well, Eircran. This is it. Good, good. That's probably another one coming. Um, because uh, it's a, a hardy lad, we could say. Yeah, we could try running up to execute it, maybe. 
Oh, good job, Erkin. Okay. All right, you can do this, buddy. Good job. Oh. <laughs> Erkin's last stand. Ugh. What <laughs> champ went down fighting, went down swinging. Not bad, not well either. Yeah, we we traded one for one, I guess. So that's something. Um, so yeah, now we can look at the horrible geoscape. Minus 400k in debt. We've lost North America and South uh, South Africa. We have a total of six troops left. I can't hire more. Uh, you can't... Well, basically, you just can't build anything. Um, everything else seems to still work, as far as I can tell. Um, the production halts, and I think research halts as well. Yeah, the odds are are horrible when you send uh, when you send uh, privates against the base. But um, I don't think I really had any any other good options. I don't know. Maybe anything else would have been better. I'm not sure. I'm not. I'm not sure that uh, my situation was salvageable. Uh, okay, well, let's take that out. Return to the base. I guess we will airstrike it. Okay. Yeah, the aircraft are all shattered. A big part of the problem is um, even when I win my air engagements, my planes are all are all busted up. <laughs> You, uh, you're, you're probably not wrong there, Fish. You're probably not wrong. Yeah. Well, that could be, uh, could be an idea. Uh, this is on Iron Mode, the uh, Iron Man, though. That's true. If I can get good at the uh, air engagements, we might be able to do much better. Uh, let's see. Oh, planes are getting patched up. So I think maybe at this difficulty, you have to take those air engagements. Not sure. Let's see, are we going to lose any other regions? It's probably just a matter of time we lose Central America. Uh, yeah, Europe is gone. Yeah, we're probably going to lose... Uh... Oh, we have an extraterrestrial base in the Middle East. Good. Very good. Well, at least we can send out another uh, attack if we really wanted to. Uh, okay, let's send these guys out after that. Anything else that could uh, realistically take it? <sighs> so many aliens. Yeah, go back to base. Pfft. 
They're just flying circles around my guys, too. You can't catch them. Got our lander back. There's no way we can take that on. So we lost all our good gear too, so now the next mission we're going to be back to square one against uh, later game uh, things. Uh, Uh, oh. Well, we just lost the base. Since I didn't have any troops there. So that's great. Alright, let's see if we, uh... What we can do, uh against this thing. <sighs> I think um I think I made things worse. So that should have been a 100% success. <laughs> and I just lost my planes. Great. <laughs> uh, hmm. I wonder how many regions I'll end up losing. Not really, because uh, um, uh, yeah, I suspect at the um, end of the month we're uh, we're going to lose. So I think uh, yeah, we're for sure losing Europe. I'm not going to be able to retake uh, the Middle East. So we're in a uh, funding death spiral at the moment. Uh, let's send a single foxtrot after it. So many aliens. Okay. So this one should be fairly easy. Yeah, okay. Okay, it's got in... Oh no, I went to actually fight that engagement. It's too bad. Send a single condor after it, see what happens. So can we kill a cruiser with a single condor? Nope. Nope, definitely not. So the cruiser outmaneuvers us. Good to know. I was thinking maybe if you can sneak uh, around behind it, uh, we'd be able to do something. But uh, apparently not. Yeah, aircraft are all screwed. 
Yeah, I think we'll just, uh... Yeah, Jakarta gets nuked. We'll just speed to the end here. <sighs> uh, Alright, we'll send off these planes. Boy. It, uh, it really ramps up quick. Uh, okay. So... So once the Foxtrot has fired its guns, it can't actually do anything. So I guess we retreat it. That makes sense. Uh, Foxtrot. It's not letting me do evasion. So that kills it. Great. Evade, evade. Use some more evading. Oh, nice, we killed it. All right, well, it cost us a fox trap. Okay, so I think that's how you you would do it. Lots of pausing when they shoot, and then. Uh, and then tell them to evade, I guess. Uh, I guess we can auto resolve it since it's hundred percent. So let's go and intercept that one. Try to intercept it, I guess. Nope, it's just flying circles around us. Yeah. Mm. All right. Let's see that end of the month. Oh, okay. Well, we can send off some uh, some more planes to die, I guess. you select a new target, go after them. Uh, it wants interceptors there. All right, let's, uh, let's engage it. We're just gonna practice these uh, these air combats. Okay. So you evade and you evade. Oh no! They need some more! Ah. Oh boy. Well, I took a 100% win and we lost. So, uh, that's great. <laughs> yeah, I still have a Illinium missiles. Uh... Seven hundred forty-eight thousand uh, dollars. Situation critical. Three continents lost. Can't pay maintenance and wages. So yeah, we just lost Europe. I'm surprised I uh, survived another month. Let's send the planes after it. A massive ship. K-1 
carrier. Well, let's en engage it. <laughs> Never. We will, all, we will always fight it out to the death. Okay. For some reason he can't dodge. Don't. Can you dodge now? No. Alright, well I guess you're dead. Oh dear. Dodge. Dodge. He's so dodging. Foxtrots can't dodge, but I, I have seen them dodge before. I thought this carrier might have been uh, coming for a land assault. Or maybe they, uh, they realize there's no point. They've already won. Terror, terror attack, terror attack in Adelaide. All right. Adelaide got nuked. There goes Australia. And uh, yeah, we're gonna get uh, game over it at the end. But you know what? We could go take a look at an alien fortress. So why don't we? Uh... Oh, I can't hire soldiers. Well, why don't we send what's left after this alien fortress? I think that'd be uh, an appropriate, appropriate send-off. We'll, we'll send our uh, our not even full squad unarmored guys with ballistic weapons against an alien fortress. What could go wrong? Uh, let's see. Barcode. Barcode, why don't you be an assault guy? Jake, we'll give you a rifle. I know you like the rifles. Bane, uh, let's make you a shield, Bane. Romateo, I know you wanted a heavy machine gun. <laughs> More rocket launchers and stun batons. Actually, you know what? We're gonna have Bane have a uh, stun baton. And then we'll, we'll, he'll have a pistol as a backup. Um, we should have a Rocketeer uh, go with a bang. Uh, let's, let's give him a stun baton too. Lots of grenades on, sure. Why not? I'll have a concussion grenade, one of these. Charge with the rocket brigade. Hmm. Alright, Dennis. What should you have, Dennis? Uh, you got pretty good reflexes, I guess. Ah, we'll just leave you as a rocket one. No, 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 Dennis. You're gonna be a shield. And we're gonna give you a stun baton as well. Alright. Buckle up, troops. We're going in. Taking on the alien fortress. Oh, I forgot to bring medkits again. Oh, no, no, they all, like I had a bunch, actually. Never mind. We'll see. We'll see what we get. All right. Did I bring medkits? I did. Okay. At least we have medkits this time. I don't think we're going to have a chance to use them. Um, so I'm pretty sure as soon as anything sees us, we're we're just going to, to die. Like immediately. All right. Ooh, we can see an alien already. Okay, he, he's a hardy fella. And it's 100% blocked. He is suppressed. So, barcode, run in there. Oh boy. <laughs> Oh boy, it's not great. Uh, Czechoslovak Jake. Uh, I 
Excellent shot. Uh, Dennis. All oh, right, you have your stun baton. <laughs> can you can you whack him? No. Bane. Can you take this guy out? No. Mateo, get out of the way. Empower. You're our last hope. Break for Jake. <laughs> okay, well, Dennis donated. We may die to the uh, first alien we encounter. I'm surprised. <laughs> Barco just got annihilated there. Oh dear. Dennis, there's an alien somewhere in there. Uh. Take some cover and power. Okay, well. Oh no! <laughs> oh, oh boy. I don't think we will ever gonna manage to kill Sam. <laughs> Teo's broken and is fleeing. Okay. My nose. No, Dennis is panicked. Uh, uh, great. Can't do anything. Jeez. <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> oh my gosh. Those privates just got. Those privates just got utterly annihilated. <laughs> Six against twenty-four. Uh, well, that went well. well let's uh, just speed uh, speed five this till the end of the month. Our <laughs> three. Let's go. Yeah, I don't think these condors can take. Yeah, I wonder who's gonna leave next. <laughs> these massive carriers flying around. Mm. Yeah, let's send these guys after. Why not? Oh, there goes the barony. So, uh, yeah, we lost our main base. Uh, 
All we've got left is, is Bangkok. Dear. Uh, I'm not sure. Maybe we'll find out. Um, but I'm probably going to game over to... Um, let's see. I'll just do nothing. And... We have literally no soldiers. I have no way of uh, deploying soldiers or getting more soldiers. Um, we've got three alien fortresses. I'm kind of hoping they do a uh, a base assault um, on on Bangkok here, and because I want to see if we game over if we lose our last base. Oh yeah, there, there was another terror attack. Like we uh, we're just doomed, completely and utterly doomed. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Predicted uh, income, negative 1.5 million. Oh boy. Come on. Base assault me. <laughs> Seven continents lost. Uh... Yeah, they don't, they don't care. Well, that's the end of Earth 2, folks. Folks, um, did not, uh, did not go swell. Hmm. <laughs> Who's next? All of them. Yeah. Uh, screaming <laughs> which are, yeah. I'm afraid there wasn't much left on, uh, after that, uh, alien fortress assault. Well. Thus, uh, thus ends attempt two at uh, beating this game on veteran. Uh, um, we'll uh, we'll be back uh, later this week with uh, Earth Three. <laughs> so we're gonna keep going until I manage to beat the game on uh, on veteran. Uh, so um, expect uh, a new batch of troopers. Just play something easy like LW. Uh, yeah, you know, some great clips are coming out of it. I don't know what LW is. Uh, there will be Caesar tomorrow. Um, I'm probably just going to do um, the uh, the challenge maps, though, because uh, I haven't... Uh... Ah, Long War from XCOM. Yeah, I'm probably just going to play the challenge maps tomorrow, though, because I haven't uh, done that in a while, and I, I just want to. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'll probably be back Wednesday evening with another stream. Oh, wait, no, not Wednesday evening. Thursday evening uh, uh, for the next installment of Cine Knots. Uh, well, possibly Tuesday. Possibly Tuesday. Um, but um, for now, that's going to be it. Um, let me take a look, see if there's uh, anyone I could raid. Uh, this will give you extra, extra channel points if you follow along on.